So this guy is ooh, he has a chakram. It comes back to you. It's like a boomerang. I like that, but he's nearsighted. So stuff that's far away is blurry. That's funny. This guy can get the use the block because he's the paladin I unlocked with that character. He's nostalgic. I don't think that's gonna matter very much. Yeah, he can summon a blade. And this one throws axes and has a dwarf, so he's shorter than normal. You never get to ride roller coasters. Huh. He's so oh, he's so heavy he can't get knocked back. That's pretty interesting. I think I'm gonna go with near the nearsighted chakram guy. Just because I want to see what nearsightedness looks like. Let's get some a lot of these novelties. Just exper let's experience those as soon as we can. I think I'm gonna just go for getting more. Let's go for more health. I could generally just use more hit points clearly, because I'm an idiot that doesn't know how to play video games. Wow. Check out that nearsightedness. Oh my god, this is disorienting. Okay. That's gonna be our experience now. There goes my 40 gold. Because whenever you have a little extra change, you just you're just gonna lose it. What an interesting visual effect. Let's see if I have a horrible death room in the fr in the first room. Nope, just a mage. Hey mage, how you doing? Die. Oh, cool. You shoot ice projectiles, but if they hit walls, they break. Good for me, bad for you. Okay, so there's a zombie right off the bat. Zombies are done. Ow, crap. I was expecting myself to go all the way down to the ground there. There we go. Things are going okay so far. Huh. Screw that guy. Right, so far, I'm, I don't think that gold disappears. It seems to be that I get to pick it up so long as I live long enough to get it. I can't believe I, my first hit was getting hit by a zombie. Those guys aren't threatening at all. I just kind of misjudged the jump. Are we at a carnival? I, can, I have a chance to win two prizes if I hit the targets. Can I break the balloons? No. Hello, hello, clown man. You are the 99999th. I don't think that's true. I think you're lying to me. I can't go left. I guess we'll, we'll find out what this is like. Hi there! Care to test your dexterity? You only get one shot, but it's free of charge. If you succeed, I'll give you a nice reward. Ten daggers to destroy eight targets. Give it a try. Okay. Uh... How do I... Oh no. But I'm blind. I'm sorry. Do I swing? So I must just hit circle. <clears throat> That's terrible. I'm bad. Hey, I hit one. I didn't hit that one. I, that was terrible. I was that was even in the right order. This isn't fair. I'm nearsighted. It's like in real life. Oh well. We today we found out I'm terrible at this. Hey, I hit two. At least you get a little gold. That's cool. But I am terrible at this. Ooh. Oh wait, did that one even go out? The okay. You could even hit eight targets. Pfft, good luck with the rest of the castle. Don't, you know what, sir? Don't make fun of me. I'm fighting for my life out here. I don't know what. Oh, hi, Chakram. Bye, Chakram. I guess that was a waste of 15 mana. Whoops. Ramp accidentally bumped circle a little bit. Now that seems dangerous. Let's see. Let's try the Chakram on this dude. No, it wasn't far enough. Oh, ow. That was also bad on my part. So I got I got a plan. Let's see. If I hit him twice, I hit him. I kill him. But I don't know if I can hit him twice before he gets a swing in. Oh crap, this one dies. This one takes three hits to kill. Okay. Hi, eyeball. You suck. <laughs> there we go. So I can do two hits in a row without getting hit back. But if I go for all three, he'll probably kill me. I guess that's all that's in this room. More gold is good, though. That's more upgrades. The more upgrades I get, the more likely I am to actually beat the first boss, and then the second boss, and so on. Oh! Now that we know that's coming. Oh. Screw, screw you, ghost man. I don't like you. Leave me alone. Can't you deal? Can't you tell I'm dealing with much more important things like knights? Hey, ghost. How you doing? There we go. Freaking eyeballs. Don't, they don't know how to give me space. There we go. I am enjoying this game so far. It actually, it feels pretty good. The only thing I don't like is just that I'm biased by Shovel Knight with the whole down attack thing. So when I reflexively try to control it the exact same way, it doesn't quite work. And I've taken some hits that way. Why does the clown get to have a picture in here? Does he live here? If he does, then why is he, he... And he knows that it's dangerous? Like, does he endorse the danger? Does he like the fact that people are just coming in here and dying? The clown's a dick. A resident dick, apparently. What do you got? More money. Yes, 800 gold. That seems like a good number so far. 
And I'm almost at full health. Let's see how fast I can screw that up. Gotta keep keep breaking tiny jars. Makes me makes me feel a little bad about myself. But you know what? Fuck those guys. I'm nearsighted. I've lived a hard life of nearsightedness. Oh, they have shockwaves that actually go really far. We have to be careful about this. Hit. Okay, so I can just combo the shit out of those guys. It looks like they don't really get much chance to fight back if I'm already hitting them. Do I want to go up or left? Let's go left. There's... There's a warning that there's fire coming at me from off screen. Let's go under here and see what's down here. Hi, go. Hi. Ah, oh, don't you dare. Don't you dare. Die. There we go. Now there's one. Now it's easy. <laughs> well, there was two of them. That could have gone bad for me. Thankfully, there's a weird shaped room that makes it really hard to cast magic. Suck it. Uh, can I reach? I can reach. I jumped freakishly high in this game. I guess, I guess that was all that was really in that room. Oh, zombies, no! I'm so scared. I say sarcastically, even though you hit me first and are basically the only source of damage I've suffered so far, zombie. I'm, I, think, I feel like I'm doing well this life. Hi, hi, hi Skellington. Ah, oh, crap, I wa No! I walked into him. That's so dumb of me to do. I'm doing so well, except for the part where I walk directly into enemies like a person who's never heard of video games before. It's a good thing those guys don't know how to rotate or attack in any other direction besides up, down, left, right. What do we have over here? We have something shooting free- yep, another one of these dudes. Gotta be careful. Blueprint found a night cape. Getting a lot of blueprints- of blueprints, wow. Blueprints! Lots of- lots of blueprints. Let's look at the map real quick. So if I go to the top of this room, there's actually a treasure. But I have to get past all of this dangerous fi fire. There we go. A little mana. Don't know if that's really worth it. Gotta be careful. Stressing me out. There's all oh, this money in the chandeliers. Uh not worth it. <laughs> not getting not going for the other one. Okay. I'm digging the way that oh. My favorite thing in a video game is just when I when it demands that I pay attention to it. Which, unfortunately, can make it difficult to let's play sometimes, because I have to talk. And talking is always kind of hard in this- Oh no. It's actually way harder to go down than up, isn't it? Can I just drop down twice? Oh yeah, I can. That's fine. But yeah, this is definitely giving me this that Dark Souls or Castlevania vibe of like, you just have to be paying- Okay. You just have to be paying a lot of attention to your surroundings and what everyone's doing. And huh? No, no, no. They get to they get to pump up the difficulty a little bit because it is a second uh, 2D side scroller game, which means it's easier to process what's happening on the screen than it might be in Dark Souls, where you have to lock onto someone with your 3D Legend of Zelda style targeting system. Huh. Aha! I have a table. Table defeats rocket launcher, I guess. So far, so good. I'm feeling good about this life. Have not found the boss chamber yet, though. Have I? I guess the only place left to go is in this room and then down and right. And that'll be how I continue forward again. Where is this room? Oh yeah, this room, I remember. Alright, so what's through here? Eyeballs! Well, now that I know, I like that you can reset a room if you're not- if you're startled by what happened in there. You can sort of go back out and be like, nope! Gonna undo those projectiles and come back when, now that I know what's gonna happen. That's a cool little quirk. Hi, guy. Fairy chest objective. Defeat all enemies. So it's just a room full of enemies I have to kill to, unlock, to open up a weird chest. Okay. Walk a little closer to me, dude. Aha! You're dead. Suck it. And you can't hit me because I'm below you, so suck it. Aha! <laughs> How'd that work for you, buddy? Oh, what's that? What's that? What's that? What's that? What's doing that? Okay, it's like the- it looks like it's one- yeah, it's one of those things that shoots the uh, projectiles up and down and left and right, except this one's better and bigger and shoots in all the directions. So I gotta be real careful about how I approach this, because this guy could get me in trouble. Huh. <laughs> oh, zombies are bad! Oh, no, 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 no! Panic mode, panic mode, panic mode, panic mode! Panic mode, panic mode, panic mode, panic- Panic mode, panic mode, panic mode, panic mode! Okay, not bad. Ah, oh, crap, there's also projectiles over there! I need a- I need a quick- Huh. Okay, so I'm bad at bullet hells, apparently. Particularly when there's gravity. Gravity makes things difficult for me. I'm already bad enough at- f I'm bad- I'm already, like, not the best at dodging object- huh. No, I'm- oh, crap. I went directly into spikes. Is this room worth it? This room's gonna get me killed. Huh. 
Ah, uh, that was poorly orchestrated. Okay, I was slain by a plonky. Ooh, I did fairly well that time, apparently. Vault lets you... Vault, vault runes let you jump in the air with X. Okay, so there, there's an upgrade where I can get a double jump, apparently. I'm enjoying this so far. There's Lady Annabelle. She is stereo blind, so she can't see in 3D. What in the fuck does that mean in a 2D game? I'm gonna have to play her just by default, huh? Trait Clonus, you... You have random muscle spasms. That's terrifying. And she and he tends to exaggerate. <laughs> uh, CIP. Congenial intensity plane. He knows no pain? Does that mean I don't know how many how much health I have? He's bald. That doesn't matter. I want to find out what being... Uh, I want to find out what not being able to see in 3D means. Let's do some upgrades. Might just get more health. Being Having more health seems handy. Also more attack. Yeah, that's Actually, yeah. I would like to deal more damage to my foes. I would also like more hit points. And more damage. There we go. These seem like reasonable thing upgrades to get early on instead of spamming too much into the uh, whole equipment part. Actually, I have 120 gold right now, so I might be able to buy some sort of equipment. 150. 250. 500. These are all way out of my range, apparently. Yep. Let's check a look at this guy. I think she had something I could buy at this price point. 175. 175. No. I'm just crazy and stupid, apparently. I thought I could afford something at 120, but apparently not. Eh. Was it back in the... Oh, wait, no, I'm thinking of, like, my first upgrade for mana is what I'm thinking of, I think. But the... Oh, wait, I never... Up I never upgraded my mana a single time, I don't think. If I'm, rem if I'm remembering correctly... Which means I can afford it. Nope, it's 180 now. Wasn't it 120 before? I must be turning into a crazy person. Oh well. Nothing to do with this money besides throw it at this Grim Reaper dude and then go back in to die again. What does it mean to not be able to see in 3D? I don't know what to think of this. Does this game exist on platforms that have 3D capability? Like is this game- maybe, maybe this game's on... Hey guy, how you doing? Like, if this game's on the 3DS or something... Oh, wait. Wait, my character is a two-dimensional object that tweaks back and forth. Was that always- I don't- was that always that way? Or was there an animation before? Ah! Uh, I can't remember if that was always that way or- Like, I don't know if I'm just noticing it now. Can these guys not hurt me in here? Because I can hurt the shit out of them. Hey, guy. Come here. Come here. Aha! Critical. Is there a reason to hurt them? Can I even get in there to get the items back if I want? It doesn't look like it. Might be killing these guys for literally no reason. But I'm okay with that. Death to the infidels! Come back here, but Oh, fuck it. He's, he's way over there now. I'm done ca caring with that. Oh, look! They... Oh, yeah, they tweak back and forth, too. I think that is new. I'm pretty sure that... I don't think that was there before. Oh! No! 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 The painting is alive! I don't like this at all! What the fuck, Nuggets? Can I break the... I can't break the white things, so the white things are just, like, a problem for me? No! What is the... Ah! Okay! I guess we're done with... I guess we're done with Lady Annabelle today! Holy shit! Okay! He's Nectomorph, he's skinny. This guy likes to exaggerate. Chickens freak you out. Are there chickens in this game? A barbarian that's nearsighted. A st stereo blind and nearsighted. Okay. Jesus Christ. Peripheral artillery events. No foot pulse. Ooh. I've heard about that. I have 60 gold. That was terrible. Look how skinny I am. Aww. <laughs> this guy has no foot pulse. What that means... I've heard about this before already. I swear, I actually, I genuinely haven't played this game before, but I've definitely, I listen to a lot of podcasts, so you, you, you learn things. I actually don't like that he's skinny. The, the change in perspective on his character is actually kind of disorienting. It looks like he's weirdly squished instead of actually just skinny. But the effect of no foot pulse. Ow. That was poorly orchestrated. Uh, because I have no Get away from me. Get away. No, motherfuckers. Because I have no foot pulse, I don't tr uh, trigger foot traps in this game. That okay, that one's moving. That one's bad. Uh, deal with this ghost first. Come here, come here. Fuck you, painting. I hate you. 
Jesus. So the first pa so apparently moving paintings are just a thing in this game, but the first one I ever encountered was the worst possible case of like of evil like giant boss painting. Maybe that always happens. It's, it's weird that they're it's weirdly conspicuous that they're everywhere now. It seems when I haven't seen one before. So maybe finding that mini boss triggers them appearing everywhere else. I don't know. Hey guy. Oh shit! You shoot projectiles. Gotta be careful with you. Huh. 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 Okay, panicking, because I know this cannon's over here. There we go, that's taken care of. The cannon was a problem, because I was trying not to get hit by projectiles coming if they came from the spear dude, but the cannon was just going to shoot them too. I'm definitely liking my upgrade. Okay, cannons easily dispatched by bouncing. Oh! Oh, come on. He sort of scraped against me, that's bullshit. There we go. Already losing too many hit points, but uh, things are going okay-ish so far. Projectiles are up there. Gotta be careful. Breaking all them chandeliers in case money happens. Huh. So definitely worth upgrading that strength, because everyone's dying faster now. Many things are dying in one hit, which is a significant change in difficulty for me. Huh. Can I break the chair? Yep. Money. Huh. We got this, guys. Oh, what are you? No, 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 no. I don't like it. You shoot through walls? I thought you guys could... I thought, I thought projectiles broke on walls. Huh. Okay, uh, no, 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 kill the, kill the big one, kill the big one, kill the big one, kill the big one, fuck you, oh, it's still alive, fuck, there we go, now it's easy, ow, and now I get hit, of course, <laughs> the moment I'm like, okay, now it's easy, and then I get the shit beat out of me, when I, I think I managed to go that far in the fight without even getting hit, why is everyone from outside in this castle, those pictures, there's a blacksmith right here, and, the sword, Enchantress right here. Are they all conspiring against me and sending my entire family on these death missions just for fun? Because that's fucked up. They seem to be very uh, aware of how fucked everything is inside here. Anything bad down here? Nope. Okay. I'm having fun. I hope this is fun to watch because I don't... I can't... I don't know if it's fun to watch. I can't tell right now. Uh, pray for assistance. Confirm? What happened? I got an item. Hedgehog's Curse. Is that good or bad? How does it work? Can I switch which one I use? Uh... I'm trying to press triangle? Triangle doesn't do anything. I don't know if I can switch... I don't know if there's a way to switch between my current MP skills. So I don't know if... I'm not sure if I, there's a way to use Hedgehog's Curse. Oh crap! How did I... How did I get that stupid? What happened to my brain that let me, that let me do that? That was so bad. I just like, hey look, a giant spike that I, goes across the- Uh! Another fairy chest. Take care of this guy first of all. Uh. Okay, so... Just gotta defeat all enemies. I, th I think I- What do I do? I, I summon a sword, I think? Just deal with this asshole skeleton! Damn you bookshelves, I don't wanna stand on you! I wanna deal with the bad guys. So that's the fairy chest that I have to kill all enemies for. So I can do a jumping attack on this thing. Uh. Not quite going as planned. Okay, I'm doing okay. Doing okay. Don't know what kind of dangers are going to be in here though, so let's be careful. Okay, landed on the landed on the bookcase, so I don't have to worry about that guy. There's okay, those spikes must not count as things I have to kill. Oh no! Look at this asshole over here throwing things at me. What made me, what made me drop all my money though? That's weird. Oh, oh! I figured it out! I have the Hedgehog's Curse. I prayed for assistance and they gave me a bad thing, not a good thing. The Hedgehog's Curse is Sonic the Hedgehog. So... Did I defeat all enemies? Is it open now? I have Hedgehog's Curse, so when I now whenever I take damage, my, I drop gold. That's bad. Siphon Rune. Ooh. I got a, I got a rune. We'll find out how that works later. For right now... Uh, I wish I'd get all that money back, but it's on spikes. I just ha I'll just i have to just continue on and try to unlock more money. Damn you eyeballs and your projectiles that go through walls. Oh no, this is this curse is the worst thing. Oh crap. I think all of my money just got erased. I think I just erased all my money by going into that other room. No. Okay, things are not going super well right now. Let's find out how the summon works. Oh my god, it's just a giant... Oh, it just hangs out. There we go, sword the crap out of that dude. So it looks like I just summon a sword that blocks attacks, I guess? Like this? Uh-oh. I can see... Okay, 
Yeah, that's what I was getting at. I can see this ending poorly. Lady Stark. Ooh. Like from Game of Thrones? 